Muy buenas de nuevo chicos y chicas A un nuevo episodio de Soma Si os acordáis lo dejamos aquí en el Zeppelin Os lo dejemos hace, lo he dejado hace como 5 minutos He descansado un poquito la voz para Poder grabar este y, y seguir jugando Un ratito más ya que tengo tiempo Como dije en el vídeo anterior al final Uy, uy, aquí hay muchos botones Y nada pues Vamos a seguir, espero que nuestro compañero ¿Por qué no te abres? Y a ver lo que hay en ese cajón y no se abre Pues espero que nuestro compañero Chispitas Nos deje Un poco tranquilos existence like that. Where are we now? Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course. Is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. You think it can get us to Theta? It's a cargo transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Ah, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Is that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. Have to deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Care to point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips? The toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Come on. I don't want to hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. I'll get us the chip. Va a ser por fin el primer arma que tenemos. que te dan y la tiras, tío. Es que... No maldito que arma que te dan y la tiras. Es que no puede ser verdad, tío. Los aquí un compañero. Así que también somos un robot, ¿no? Porque se ve, pero no somos un robot. Un poco más avanzado que el resto. Aunque ahora nos veamos los pies, no estamos jugando con cualquier cosa. Acabamos de reventar. 
Ferrari, el pobre robot, que no tenía ninguna culpa de nada. Sí, estaba un poco demente, como dice. Pero al fin y al cabo no hacía nada. Ah, estaréis viendo esto azul. Y es que cuando empieza a hacer frío, pues es el saco de dormir, que lo, lo, lo usamos aquí en casa de, de Manta. Como si fuera eso, vamos, como si estuviéramos de acampada. Pues no veáis lo que abriga, yo lo aconsejo, la verdad. En vez de una manta, un saco de dormir y vais a estar más calentitos. Me pica la nariz, cuando me pongo nervioso me pica la nariz. You're really good back there, Simon. We got a slight delta detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We should touch down on a cargo platform just outside Theta. Then we just head inside, grab the duck back, and head down the abyss. 4,000 meters. That's a long way. We don't have to worry though, because with the duck back, The Ark could have been in the Mariana Trench. It'll hold for anything. That's great. And then we can start listening to other people when they talk, because that's how conversations work. What? Oh, sorry. I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears. No mouth. Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, We're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside Theta, okay? Sí, sí. Teta, teta, compañero, no mires nada más. Teta, pero estamos en el teta, en el teta. Solo cojo no me gusta. Vamos a cambiar. Strasky, wake up, Doctor Masters. We're bringing in anchors. What's wrong? What can I say? Is that a rough day? Pero, ay, que te, pues tengo sueño ya. Esta mañana a la otra mañana. ¿Eh? Robin Bass, Theta Field Service Technician. Nice to meet you, Robin. Madre mía, pobre Robin. Vaya trozo de chatarra está hecho nuestro amigo Robin.
rollo que chaval. Hello? Anyone there? Es la típica sala de los enemigos. Extraño, ¿no? Si es que está todo cerrado. <risas> Cuidado, no te has llevado, ¿sabes? Vale, irme no puedo. Así que nos tenemos que quedar aquí. que acabo de descubrir lo que tengo que hacer. Creo, vaya. Así es. Maldito mal rollo todo esto que te cagas. Vale, ahora lo ponemos. Vale, ya, es un ordenador. Esto es modding puro, eh. Mira la webcam. Seguro que esa webcam es mejor que esta. Madre mía. We're here. We're here. Okay, great. Time to hijack ourselves a submarine. There will be nothing stopping us when we have the done that. You guys sure have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes this one so special? 
It's the only transport that can go into the Abyss without cracking like a can of soup. If this is one of a kind, then how did they get the Ark down the Abyss in the first place? That's a good question. I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Didn't realize that was an option. Kath, what's it like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know, like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant temperature, clean air, good weather. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? You don't have to pretend. It's perfectly immersive. And it can just sustain itself? Yes. Attached to a probe fueled by solar panels, it could survive for thousands of years. That's amazing. Just thinking about the Earth being what it is and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... It's... Heroic? Uh, at least it feels worth doing. Here we go. The Dunbat! Oh, damn it. I knew it was too good to be true. What's wrong? It's... It, it's quarantined. Hold on. We need a security cipher. How bad is it? It's we don't write these things down type of bad. Maybe someone's still around who can tell us what it is. Hmm. Sure, let's go with that. I'll just unlock the other doors for you so you can explore the station. We need to find someone who knows the cipher. It's the only way to fire up the Dunbat. Find someone who knows the security cipher. Looks like all your friends moved downstairs. Why abandon the gate? In the habitat? That's so strange. I don't like this at all. real helpful report. Be quiet, the proxy listens. What happened to Theta? No explanations anywhere. Kind of sounds like a warning. Suena como que no hagas mucho ruido porque te van a pillar y te van a reventar. Dice cabrón, algún día este juego. Lo malo es que ahora saldrá el Black Ops y me conozco y voy a dejar este juego de lado por un tiempo y no quiero hacer eso. Porque luego me volverá a dar miedo. Why would they all leave this floor? I don't get it either. It's like they all just cleared out. Should we go check? Rather not. How is that feeling about this? No hace falta que lo digas. Queda una espina, ¿sabes? Maldita bastarda. Yo sé que da una espina esto. Pero es que me, me gusta estar aquí. Dos veces seguidas, ¿sí? ¿Sí? ¿En serio? Serio. 
Maybe they wanted to keep close to the shuttle station in case something went wrong. You're really stuck on that one. I'm just worried about my colleagues. que me ahorro ese mal trago de subir y bajar por ahí aquí te digo yo que por ahí va a entrar porque va a salir ahora uy eso eso es un mal maldita celda ¿no? Láser de electricidad te lleva por y calor y ahí pff, ondas. Vale, sigamos en este camino. No son celdas, son habitaciones. Las habitaciones de. That's my room. You want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. Vale, entonces esta es la habitación de la de la chavala esta. I seriously doubt you'll find anything useful in there. You have a lot of toys. You don't have to search my room. We'll get by. What's a little projector? Looks like that. That's my attempt at building a vivarium. It's kind of a proto arc. Nos quedan dos habitaciones por aquí. Asteroide, ¿no? Parece. Se estaba investigando lo que son las, las cosas estas que metemos la mano dentro. Este se lo estaba tomando en serio. Si se ha suicidado, o sea, en esa carta de ese hombre se ha suicidado en teoría. Se ha suicidado, pero es como que se dice que se ha ido a. Oh, 
Vale. Esto de decir yo también suicidas. Simplemente un ratillo. Esta es española porque parece eso español. Siempre Tienes que tocar Tienes que tocar lo que no hay que tocar Es que... What the hell are you doing? I know it looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better Helps me focus That's... I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up to I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it <sighs> Let's just keep going Entonces eso no es bueno Pues no sé si seguirá haciendo algo. Vale, antes se encendían, ahora ya no. Antes se encendían, ahora ya no. No podíamos pasar, se me están poniendo los pelos de punta, chavales. No os imagináis el mal rato que estoy pasando ahora mismo. Vale, no funcionas. Si hay algo, voy a correr como un hijo puta. Parece que no hay nada ahí. Y esto va a estar cerrado. Ah, bueno, se puede abrir. This is where I did my scan. And all the others, I suppose. You don't remember? My scan was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. Pasaban de aquí, lo pasaban a las máquinas, ¿no? Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab, the scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? Um, laser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please! I'm so close. Strohmeyer's gonna shut down the art project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300-pound body out of the lab. I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. Ah, I see. What? Check the terminal. I just want to make sure. David Munchy. How did this? What is this? Kath, what is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munchie's templates. A legacy scan. But no llamaba Simon. Simon. Mm -hmm. What's a legacy scan? They're historic templates for AI construction. Any self-respecting engineer wouldn't use legacies anymore, but they're grateful earning. 
They come with every development kit. So, my brain scan turned into a template for artificial intelligence. You should be proud. So much for that mystery. No magic or time travel needed. I was here all along. Waiting for someone to shove a picture of my brain into a suit and hit the power button. que lo que vamos a tener que hacer es ir al, ir al nivel inferior y darle a la conexión para luego volver a subir aquí. No queda otro. This is where I would store the arc scans. Are they similar to my legacy file? No, yours is flatter, if that makes sense, less dynamic. Thanks. That makes me feel much better. Vale chicos y chicas, aquí vamos a dejar nuestra investigación por hoy Mañana continúe el grabando seguramente Bueno, no lo quiero decir muy alto porque luego pasa lo que pasa Y es, paso una semana sin subir vídeos Suicidio, por favor, para mí aquí Así que nada Espero que os esté gustando a mí La verdad es que, bueno, ya lo he dicho mil veces Es un juego que me pone súper nervioso Pero la ambientación es, es increíble Me, me gusta ese, esa intriga de, de, de qué va a ser el siguiente paso Esos ruidos, ¿veis? Que es lo que nos va a deparar. Así que nada, si os gusta vosotros también, pues podéis dejar vuestro pulgar arriba que ayuda. Dejar algún comentario que otro uh, sobre cómo estáis viendo el juego. Uh, si es para vosotros el mejor de 2015, como he sentido que se dice. Yo creo que sí que va a ser el mejor juego de miedo, de terror de 2015. Mi opinión, mi humilde opinión. Y ya veremos al final qué pasa. Así que nada, un enorme abrazo. Y como siempre digo, nos vemos en el próximo vídeo.